Hi meine Lieben, ich hoffe es geht euch gut, mir geht es sehr gut, ich habe den ganzen Tag in der Sonne gesessen und äh, hoffe, dass ihr einen entsprechend tollen Tag hattet und jetzt ready seid für MyClubs Live mit einem neuen Workout, denn jeden Tag, immer um 18 Uhr, bringen wir die besten Trainer unserer äh, Partnerstudios hierher, um mit euch Sport zu machen und heute haben wir Christina und ihren Mann Ricky mit dabei, Christina ist schon da, hi, Hello, so good to have you here. Christina is from Scotland, was yes. that right? Yes. Okay, so we have this talk in English. I will translate from time to time. Ich werde das immer mal wieder übersetzen, aber wir sprechen auf Englisch, weil Christina aus Schottland ist. So the workout is also going to be in English, right? Yes. Tell us a bit about the workout, because I already saw you wrote down shitloads <laughs> of, I don't know, exercises. Is yeah. it going to be hard? It should be. Okay. If it's not, you're not working hard enough. So, um, yeah, we have a Tabata workout today. So HIIT training, high intensity interval training. Um, the aim of Tabata is to get the heart rate sky high, work really hard, burn loads of calories, really challenge your body. Um, and with this form of training, you will hopefully be burning calories for the next 24 hours more than you would if you hadn't done the training. But that doesn't mean go and eat loads of cake. Don't do that. <laughs> okay, so I'll translate. Uh, also es wird uh, hoffentlich ein relativ hartes Workout uh, mit um, einer ziemlich hohen Her Herzfrequenz, die euch um, ja, sehr viel uh, schnaufen lässt und uh, den Schweiß treibt. Aber das ist ja auch gut, denn ihr werdet sehr viele Kalorien verbrennen, hoffentlich noch die nächsten 24 Stunden weiter. Ihr solltet deshalb trotzdem keinen Kuchen essen. So, okay, I think we got <laughs> genau. that. You brought Ricky with you, so are you doing the workout as well or is he working and you yes, are just Yes, so combining? I'm going to do the workout, but my husband Ricky is here to show the alternatives. So okay. that if somebody at home can't do something like jumping, Ricky can show what they can do instead. Okay, alles klar. Also sie macht das Workout mit ihrem Mann Ricky zusammen. Und das bedeutet, äh, sie macht die Übungen in der harten Variante und Ricky zeigt die Alternativen. Also die, wenn jemand vielleicht nicht ganz so fit ist, dann äh, kann er eine leichtere Version davon machen. Die wird der Ricky zeigen. Uh, and uh, last but not least, is there going to be music or shall we just recommend some music for the workout? Um, I don't have music, but... Um You can search for hit playlists on Spotify. Anything that's high energy, pop, fun music really helps, I think. Or okay. if you like something different, all good. <laughs> Alles klar, also Musik frei wählbar, aber wenn ihr möchtet, guckt auf Spotify die Hit-Workout-Playlists, die es da so gibt. Die sind auf jeden Fall voll mit energiegeladener Musik. Also los geht's. And uh, my definite last question for, to, uh, for at the moment, actually. Uh, Are there uh, any of your workouts online already? Yes, um, so I'm doing workouts every day at the moment and we're uploading them to my YouTube channel. Okay, um, cool. So helping through New Wave Gym, of mm. course, and on my YouTube channel. So I can link that or I can of say course, the name now. Just put the question into the um, chat and then you yeah. can answer. Right? Super. Also wenn ihr möchtet, könnt ihr in den Chat Fragen stellen, dann äh, kann die Christina antworten und äh, selbstverständlich, wenn ihr noch mehr Sport wollt, dann gibt es den auf myclubs.com oder über die App, selbstverständlich auch das New Wave Gym. Und jetzt viel Spaß mit diesem Hit Workout. Los geht's. So have fun, enjoy guys. Thank you. I will join you over there. Super. Okay, thank you. Yeah, perfect. Okay, so um, for the workout, we'll start with a warm-up. Um, I'm going to use my phone timer. We have five exercises, each one 25 seconds, um, no rest, and we'll do two rounds, so just warming up the whole body. I'm just going to show you them quickly, and then we'll all start together. So the first one that we'll do is a squat with a reach. So for the squat, you stand shoulder width or slightly wider than shoulder width with the feet, Toes pointing out slightly, and then we squat down as low as we can, and then reach up high. So squat, reach up high. Then we have um, reverse lunge to high knee. So reverse lunge to high knee. Lunge down with the knee as close to the floor as you can, and then lift the knee up. We'll do two each leg for 25 seconds. And then we have butt kicks and a chest opener. So butt kicks like this. And then with the arms, open up the chest. So the arms come behind you like this. Then we have um, a squat with a side leg raise. So again, we squat down, keep the legs straight, lift the leg up to the side, keep the hips facing forwards, okay? And the last one is a walk out with a tap. So for this one, we're going to walk forward from here and then tap left, tap right, stand up, squeeze the glutes and repeat, okay? And Ricky's going to do this one with me, if it's good. Cool. So. Put your music on and let's get ready to go in 10 seconds. So, first one is the squat reach in four, three, two, one. Let's go. So down and then reach up. 
twist up, really warming up the whole body here. Good. Remember to keep those knees in line with the toes, really important. Good job. 10 seconds more. Down and up. Good. One more after this. And next, take it into the reverse lunge with the high knee. So down and then up, two on each side. Get those hips warmed up, nice. And then switch after two, other side. Help with your range of motion here. And we might have some high knees in the workout, so this could be why we're warming up this. 10 seconds, good job. Down and up, good. Two more, down and up, down and up. Okay, next take it into the butt kicks. So try to take the feet to your bum and then with the arms across like this, open out the chest. Good, nice. So when you do this, it looks like this from the side. And when you're doing it, you should feel it here as well. Super. Good. Five, four, three, two, one. Okay, take it into the squat leg raise. So squat stance and then left, squat right. So you're keeping that leg as straight as you can. Hips forward. Let's go. Down and up. Good. Try to keep those hips forward. Super. Nice. Hopefully you're feeling warmed up already. Good. Also important, trying to keep the chest up. Don't do this, okay? Down and up. Super. One more. Okay, let's take it into the walkout with the tap. So you can come this way as well. Walk forwards and then tap, tap. Let's go. When we stand up, squeeze the glutes, activate your glutes, and repeat. Down, tap, tap, and up. When you do this, keep your core really tight. Down, up, and up. Good. One more. Down, tap, tap, walk up. And we'll repeat that round one more time. So, into the squat with a reach. So. And three, two, one, let's go. Squat, reach up, really stretch up high. Good. Keep that back straight as well. Try not to do this, okay? Squat down as low as you can. Reach up, down and up. Good. 15 seconds to go. Super. Down and up. Good job. One more. Okay, reverse lunge to high knee, one more time. Lunge down, pull the knee up, and switch. Good job. Super. Down and up. Nice work. 15 seconds to go. Nice. Switch side, 10 more seconds. Down and up. Two more. And pause. Good. Okay, into the butt kick. So this time we're going to switch out and do shoulder circles, okay? Forwards, let's go. Open up the shoulder joint. Good. Keep that going. Keep those feet coming up to the bum. Super. And backwards. Take the arms backwards. Good. Five, four, three, two, one. Into the squat leg raises. Down, leg up. Other side. Let's go. Good. Remember to keep those hips forward. Try not to do this, okay? Down and up. Good job. Super. 15 seconds more. Down and up. Good job. One more each side. 
And last one, walk out with a tap. So we walk forwards, then tap, tap, come back up, squeeze the glutes, repeat. Let's go. Down, tap, tap, and up. Good. Down, down, tap, tap. Super. Keep it going. Tap, tap. Good job. Me one more. Tap, tap, and come up to standing. So, hopefully we're warmed up. Um, yeah. <laughs> Does that feel like one round? <laughs> okay. <laughs> so, how it's going to work? I'll just show you each Tabata round. Um, so I'll show you the two exercises, then we'll do the block, we'll pause, and then we'll do the next one. So, block one, we have crisscross squat jumps and high knees. So, the crisscross squat jump. We start again in the squat stance, so hips forward, chest stays up, back stays straight, knees in line with toes, and then we squat down, and we crisscross jump, and then backwards, okay? So the first time, it comes forward, and the next time switch, go backwards, okay? Um, Ricky, for the alternative, if you can't do jumping, a normal squat, and then tap back. So tap, tap, squat, okay? Ricky will do that for anyone that has maybe some knee troubles. And then the next one is high knees. So fast as you can, as high as you can, like this. If you can't do that, then alternative knee taps, right? Good. So, 20 seconds each exercise, four rounds, it's a total of four minutes, okay? Maximum effort here. Um, if it feels too easy, then go harder. So, eight intervals, 20 seconds, 10 seconds off. Hopefully, we're ready to go, yeah? Timer started in five, four, three, two, one, let's go. So, down. And then straight down, crisscross. Down, crisscross. Good. Super work. Down, crisscross. Come down as low as you can in that squat. Keep the chest up. You don't want to do this, okay? Chest always up. And pause. Now we do high knees. So Tabata is always 20 seconds on, 10 seconds off. Let's go, high knees. Fast as you can. So hoch wie möglich, so schnell wie möglich. Go, go, go. Good. 10 seconds. Five, four, three, two, one. Pause. <laughs> and it's only round one. Okay. Round two in three, two, one. Let's go. Squat. Crisscross, crisscross. Remember to switch directions each time. Good. Try to add in a squat there if you can. So you come up, tap back, good. One more. Pause. Grab 10 seconds to breathe. Tabata is not easy. High knees in three, two, one, let's go. Fast, fast, fast. Good. Super work. 10 seconds to go. Four, three, two, one. Pause. Whoo. Oh, man. You're going to have to do the rest, Ricky. Just kidding. Crisscross jumps. Let's go. Squat. Crisscross. Good job. Super work. 10 seconds to go. This one's quite good if you're used to doing normal squat jumps. Just changing it up a bit. Pause. Good. Okay. High knees. In four, three, two, one. Let's go. High knees. Fast, fast, fast. Use those arms. Good. 
Nobody said it was going to be easy. Super. Four, three, two, one. Okay, one more round. Yeah. Last round. Three, two, one. Crisscross squat jumps. Let's go. Down, crisscross. Good. Squat down as low as you can. Keeping that chest up all the time. Good. One more. Pause. Okay. We're going to high knees next. Last one. Ready? Let's go. High knees. Fast, fast, fast. Good. You're doing amazing, everyone. I hope you're not sitting on the sofa yet. Four, three, two, one. Pause. Good job. Okay. We're going to have two minute break. And during that time, I will show you the next round, okay? Good job. Drink some water right now. If you set your timer. How are we doing? Good? Woo! And this is how Tabata should feel. Even if you're a really trained athlete, Tabata should be hard. Woo! If it's not, I want to know your secret. Okay. So, next round. More explosive exercises. We have jumping pulse lunges and squat leg raises. We did those in the warm up. So the jumping pulse lunge. We do a jumping lunge, then we pulse down one, two, three, then we jump. So important for the lunge is that your knee is not in front of the toe. Okay, it should be behind the toe. And then the back leg comes down. Don't do this, okay? You shouldn't keep your leg straight, you should lunge it. Then we pulse one, two, three, switch sides, one, two, three, okay? Alternative, just um, no jumping, reverse lunge with a pulse. So, alternative, one, two, three, come up, switch sides, one, two, three. Ricky will do the alternative. And then the next one is a squat leg raise. So, working the legs and also more focus on the glutes here, or the bleaks. So, we squat down, keep the legs straight, squat down, leg straight. Round one left, round two right, round three left, round four right, okay? Good. Um, sorry, yeah, alternative. If you can't do the squat, just, um, sorry, if you can't do the leg, straighten, squat, and then a small crunch, okay? If you find it difficult with your range of motion. So, I think we're good to go in 10 seconds. Ready, Ricky? Yay! So, jumping pulse lunges in five, four, three, two, one. So, one, two, three, pulse. Then we switch. One, two, three, and we switch. Two, three, pulse, and we switch. Two, three, and we switch. One, two, three. Good job. Knees close to the floor as you can. And switch. One, two, three. One, two, three. Pause. Okay. The pulse adds in an extra bit of intensity, like we didn't have enough with the jumping. Squat leg raises, lift the left leg, let's go. Squat, leg raise, or squat and crunch, good job. Leg raise, try to keep the legs straight, the hips facing forwards, good. Squat, leg raise, super. Two more, two, one, pause. Whew. Okay. <laughs> Second round is hell, right? <laughs> Jumping lunges. Can you try from the side so people can see from the side? That would be great. Super. Let's go. One, two, three. One, two, three. Pulse down. One, two, three. Try to do the jump in one movement. Two, three. Jump. One, two, three. One, two, three. Five seconds. One, two, three. Pause. Whew. Good. 
So remember which leg you did before and switch sides. Squat, leg raise, let's go. Leg raise. If you can't do it, follow what Ricky's doing with the crunch. Leg raise. Good. You might find squeezing your core really helps you keep stable with this one. Good. One more. Pause. Whew. Halfway already. Easy. No, not easy. Never gets easier. Let's go. One, two, three. Switch. One, two, three. Pulse down low. Two, three. One, two, three. Good job. One, two, three. Halfway. Two, three. One, two, three. One, two, three. Pause. <sighs> okay. Other side leg raises. In three, two, one. Let's go. That pause goes so quickly. Whew. Super. Squat down as low as you can. Don't neglect the squat because of the leg raise. Still go low. Good. Down. Squat. Down. Two more. One more. And pause. Okay. We are on the last round. Whoo! Doing amazing, guys. Keep it going. Jumping lunges. One, two, three. Other side. One, two, three. One, two, three. One. Whoops. Don't fall. Good. One, two, three. One, two, three. One, two, three. Whoo! Felt like I was skiing there. Fall over when I ski and snowboard. Yeah, don't laugh. He does too. No, he's better. Ready? Let's go. Other side. Squat, leg raise. <sighs> leg raise. Good job. Down and up. Hips forwards always. <sighs> Good. <sighs> Three more. Three. Two. One more. One. Pause. Okay. Two minute break. Have some water. Then we go on to block three. Whew. Yeah. I love Tabata. It's at the time you hate it, but when it's done, you'll feel really good. Good. Okay. So, yeah, today with the workout, we're working full body with body weight only. So, if you're at home, and you feel like you're not, you don't have much ideas for um, body weight, there is loads that you can do, as you can see today. So, round three, we have front jacks and power jumps. So a front jack is just a variation of a jumping jack. So for the jumping, uh, the front jack, we start like this, and we jack out fast like this, okay? So the arms stay straight, core is tensed, and we do this, okay? Um, if for any reason it's difficult to jump, then Ricky will do the alternative, which is tap, tap, okay? And then the next one is a power jump. Woohoo! Power jumps. We start, what might they be, huh? We start like this, about shoulder width apart, and then we bring the knees to the hands, which are here, like this, okay? You can do the full 20 seconds jumping, or I'm gonna do one jump, three um, fast feet, like this. One jump, one, two, three, one, two, three, okay? Ricky is going to do a variation, which is like a step up, step up tap. So he's going to pull, pretend he's going on a step, and push his knees forward, okay? That's a variation that you're gonna do if you can't jump. Good, so, perfect timing, 10 seconds to go. We start. Ready? <laughs> Seven, six, five, four, three, two, one, front jack. So, fast as you can. Working on mobility in the upper body too. Fast, fast, fast. 
As soon as those feet come back in, jack out again. Side to side. Two, one, pause. It's power jump time. Yay. So if you're crazy and you want to just keep power jumping, that's cool. Three, two, one, let's go. So up and then you can do one, two, three. Or you can do this. Woo! 10 seconds. Pause. Okay, I'm done. I'm going home. <laughs> we good? You like yours better, he says. Okay, front jacks in three, two, one, let's go. Front jacks. Woo! Tabata can be so evil. Super. Keep those arms straight for front jacks. More energy. Four, three, two, one. Pause. Whew. Okay. Power jumps in. Three, two, one. Let's go. Nice. Try to bend your knees more when you do that. Yes. One, two, ten seconds. Keep it going. And pause. Nice work, guys. Whew. Halfway. Ready for front jacks in three, two, one. Let's go. Front jacks. Arms straight. Move fast. Super. You're doing amazing, guys. Well done. Five, four, three, two, one. Pause. Oh, wow. Power jumps in three, two, one. Let's go. You can keep jumping if you want. Halfway. Knees high. Pause. Okay, last round. I feel like I should not worn makeup today. It was a bad idea. <laughs> Ready? Front jacks, let's go. Last round, you can do this. Woo. Fast. Super work. 10 seconds. Three, two, one. Last power jacks, then they're over. Whew. Let's get ready to go in. Three, two, one, power jumps. Two, three. Good. 10 seconds. Seven, six, five, four, three, two, one. Woo! Pause. Wow. Good news. We're halfway. Or is it bad news if you thought we'd done more? So, it's so warm in Vienna today, right? Makes working. Huh? <laughs> Wednesday fun. It is Wednesday, right? Is anybody else losing track of what day it is with lockdown? I am. Okay. It's gonna get no easier the next round, I'm afraid. We have a burpee into a squat hold and an air jack, which is like a jumping jack, but a bit more crazy. So, burpee into the squat hold. It's just a two second squat hold, okay? So for the burpee, we take the hands to the floor, we jump back, knees, legs, chest to floor, and then we come up into a squat hold, okay? So for the squat hold, try to be parallel with at the floor with the leg here, and then we come back down like this. 
The back should be straight, so not curved. Alternative that Ricky will do, if you feel this is too much for you, half burpee, step back, so like this. Okay, that's an alternative. And then we have air jacks. Whew. The air jack, you have one point of contact on the floor. So you start with your feet together, arms and legs straight, <laughs> and then we air jack, okay? Ricky will do the alternative, which is a normal jumping jack, or side tap, okay? Whew, perfect timing, 10 seconds to go. So, we're gonna start in five, four, three, two, one. I'm just gonna move the mat. So down into the burpee, and then we come up into that squat hold, one, two, and repeat. Down, and repeat. Good. So keep the tension in those legs. Down and up, one more, and pause. Okay, air jacks in five, four, three, two, one, let's go. So arms and legs straight. Super, 10 seconds. If it gets too much, do what Ricky's doing. Four. Three, two, one. Whew. Pause. Do you need a mat or are you good? Okay, so burpee into squat hold. Let's go. Chest, legs to floor. Jump in, squat hold, repeat. Sorry, my microphone went a bit weird there. And repeat. Good. One more. Last one. Good job. Pause. Wow. I'm regretting putting these in. <laughs> Air jacks, let's go. Super. Keep going, guys. My microphone's falling off. Keep going. Good job. 10 seconds. Push it. You can do this. If you're sitting down, get back up. Three, two, one. <sighs> Halfway. I know. I feel your pain. Do you feel their pain, Ricky? Burpee to squat hold. Let's go. Down. Jump in. And repeat. Down. And up. Repeat. Good job. Back stays straight. One more. Okay. Air jacks, guys. Three, two, one. Let's go with the air jacks. Good. Keep that going, guys. Well done. Ten seconds. Five, four, three. Two, one. Okay, last round. Burpee into squat hold. <sighs> Three, two, one. Let's go. Down and up. Whew. Nearly there. Last round. One more. Okay. Whew. Air jacks. Three, two, one. Let's go. Air jacks. I'm going to jumping jack this one, guys. You keep going. If you can do the air jacks, do them. Eight, seven, six, five, four. Three, two, one. Pause. Oh, oh man. Now we're gonna do the whole time thing one more time. I'm just joking, we're not. <laughs> 
So, two blocks left. These ones, there's no jumping. Good news, right? We're gonna focus on the core and a little bit of the upper body. So, um, Ricky, you'll need a mat for this one. So, just over there, yeah. So, next round we have commando planks, one of my favorite. Um, really lets you work the arms as well as the core. And then shoulder taps. So, oh. commando planks. We start like we're gonna hold a plank. So on the floor, we start like this with the shoulder above the elbow. Then your body stays in a straight line. So don't do this with the hips. You want to be in a straight line and your core is really working to stop you falling from the ground. So tense that core and then we're gonna come up and down with the arms. So from here, we're gonna come up, up, down, down, and then with the other side, down, down. So up left, up right, down right, down left. Up right, down right, yeah, switch sides, you know what I mean. Um, Ricky will do the alternative, which is from the knees. If you're doing it from the knees, make sure you still have tension in your core. So don't do this, okay? Lean forward at an angle, tense the core up and down. The aim is to do this as fast as you can, okay? And then the next one is shoulder taps. So shoulder is above the wrist. Again, we keep the core tense and the hips straight. Then left, right, left, right, okay? That's round five or six. We good? Um, alternative is just on the knees again. So if it gets too difficult, come on to the knees like Ricky does, okay? So um, do you want to maybe, yeah, I think you're okay there. So we're gonna start in 10 seconds with the commando plank. So Ricky's gonna do it from his knees. I'm gonna do it on my toes, hips straight. Then come up right, down right, and repeat. So each time, switch sides, and you're trying to keep the rest of the body as still as you can, okay? Don't swing the hips. Down, down, up, up. 10 seconds to go. One more up and down. Good job, pause. Next is the shoulder tap. So shoulder above the wrist, core tense, then we tap left, right, and let's go. So if you're doing it from the knees, make sure there's an angle fast as you can. Tap, 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 tap. Yes, good. <sighs> 10 seconds to go. Tap, 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 tap. <sighs> Keep those hips as still as you can. Four, three, two, one. Pause. Okay. Uh, maybe for the next round, if you move the mat so it's a bit sideways. It's okay just now. Okay, so. Let's go. Commando planks. Up, up, down, down. Up, up, down, down. Switch arms each side that you come up with. 10 seconds to go. Good job. Down, down, and pause. Good. Okay, on to the shoulder tap. So I'm just gonna Stand next to Ricky and show you that, keep it going. The body should not move at the bottom, so he's just moving his arms. He's not twisting his hips, okay? That's the right way to do it. Keep that core tense, good job. Five, four, three, two, one, good. Yeah, can you just switch onto this mat with me and we'll show it from the next side. Okay, halfway. Commando plank, so let's go with Ricky. So if you're doing the alternative, you see how he angle at his hips? So he's keeping the tension on the core. Down, down, up, up, faster, go faster. 10 seconds, good. Nice work. Down, down, up, up, switch sides each time. Down, down, up, up, and pause. Good. <laughs> Everyone good at home, I hope? So this one. From the side, shoulder taps. This time, try and go faster. So, an angle here again. Tap, 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 fast, fast, fast. Left, right, left, right, left, right. Good job. Nice work. 
I'm not skiving here, I'm just <laughs> taking a second to show you how he's moving here. Good, five, four, three, two, one, good. In case you don't know the word skiving, it's a Scottish word which means taking a break. <laughs> okay, so last round, commando planks. Ready, let's go. So down, down, up, up, fast as you can. Down, down, up, up, keep those hips as still as you can. Down, down, up, up, down, down, up, up. Really work in the core and the triceps and the shoulders. Pause. <sighs> Whoa. Okay, last one, then we break. Shoulder taps, as fast as you can, let's go. Tap, 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 tap. Squeeze your core. If it's too easy, go faster. Good. Two, one, and pause. Good job. How are we doing? Good? Wow. We have one more round only for the core again. So grab some water and then we'll do the last one. I hope everyone at home is good. This is really tough. So please make sure that you are drinking water when you need it. Um, if I say keep going, if you feel dizzy at any point, please do break obviously. Um, but do what you can do for this last round, okay? So we have tuck-ins. Um, exercises always have a few different names wherever you go. So this one could be full extensions or tuck-ins. So, um, okay, if you can just lay your mat out, that would be great in this way, yeah. So for tuck-ins, this one is really working the core to bring the whole body together up and down. So, oh, you did tell me to move my microphone and I forgot. So um, tuck-ins. We start like this with the back flat, not curved, it should be flat. And then we pull the arms to the knees, we come back down, okay? Alternative that Ricky will do, um, the same movement pattern, but we keep the arms, the hands flat. So we start like this, and then we pull the knees to the chest, okay? So it's not so intense with the full body. Then we have heel taps, so we're gonna work core including obliques for the heel taps we bring the chest um, the shoulders off of the floor slightly and then we're just going to tap left to right so we're not crunching up and down we're staying at this level and we're moving side to side imagine that you have a plank above you here and you're trying not to touch it okay side to side and that's the last round um, I think we're good with that one for an alternative. If it gets too, um, if it gets too difficult with keeping your shoulders off of the ground, you can support your head with your hands and just move side to side like this, okay? So, last round. We are gonna start in 10 seconds. So, tuck ins. Control this movement. Don't do it too fast so that you're curving your back, okay? Ready? Let's go. So, fully extend the body, then pull the knees to the chest. Good. All the time when you come back, that back should be flat. You don't curve it here, okay? Really important. So, squeeze the core when you come down. Pause. Okay, heel taps. This one feels easier than all the jumping, right? Okay. Three, two, one, bring the chest slightly off the floor and then tap your heels. It's, it's not easy though, is it? I'm lying. Whew. 10 seconds. Good, tap and tap. Four, three, two, one, pause. I really feel that in the center of my core as well. All over, but a lot here. So. Full extensions, let's go. Knees up to chest and try to keep those feet off of the floor. 
If you need to, tap them down, but the aim is to keep that tension in the core the whole time. Down and up. Two more. One more. And pause. Whoo, burning. Is it burning? Good. <laughs> He's going to hate me later. <laughs> okay, three, two, one. Chest up, then tap and tap. Keep breathing normally. Don't hold your breath with this one, okay? 10 seconds. Whoo! Keep it going. You can do this. Five, four, three, two, one. Halfway. You're all doing amazing. I know you're working hard, even though I can't see you. <laughs> Full extensions. Are we ready? Let's go. Last two minutes. Down and up. Good. Always remember not to curve the back. Knees to chest. Good. Give me two more. One more. Pause here. Super. Whew. The end is in sight, I promise. Ready. Let's go. Heel taps. So, shoulders slightly up. Tap left and right. If it feels too easy, take your feet closer. If it feels too hard, move your feet further away so that you have to twist more. Four, three, two, one. Woo! Last round. You can do this. One minute to go. Full extensions. Let's go. In, down, and up. Good. Super. 10 seconds to go. Give me two more. Two, one, pause. Last exercise, heel taps. You're doing amazing. You've got one more to go. I believe in you. Let's go. Can you believe in me too? This is hard. <laughs> Whew. 15 seconds. Don't give up. 10, 9, 8, 7, 6, 5, 4, 3, 2, 1. That was the best sound ever, that alarm saying it's the end. <laughs> oh, man. How are we doing? Good, Ricky? Super. So, well done, to, guys. Tabata is complete. Um, now we'll do a cool down and some stretching. Really important. Um, make sure that you're bringing your heart rate back down to the normal rate. So grab your water and then wherever you are, just start to walk around the room slowly, okay? And then breathe in through the nose, out through the mouth. Start to slow down your breathing. It's really important that you don't all of a sudden stand still because then you might feel dizzy, your blood pressure might go a bit crazy, and yeah, you might fall over, so keep moving. Okay. There you go, Ricky. So I hope you enjoyed the Tabata workout. That was a tough one. Okay. So I'm just gonna set my timer and we'll do some stretches. Keep walking around. One, two, three, four, five, six. Okay, we're going to hold each stretch for 20 seconds. So the first one that we'll do as we walk around, we'll just take the shoulder, stretch out the shoulder. So pull the lower arm in towards your body and then just keep moving around slowly, breathing slowly. And hold it here. Good job. Whew. Feels good now after the Tabata, right? <laughs> Five seconds more. Pull that arm in towards your body. Switch arms. Good job. So yeah, um, keep looking out for New Wave Gym. Super Gym and Lena and her team are the amazing. So thanks for having me here tonight at my club. It's been really great. Um, and then take the hands up, loosen up the upper body and just move it forwards and back. 
um you can check out my instagram and youtube for workouts so just we can send you the links good job keep moving keep active at home nice okay next for the triceps from the um, commando plank shoulder taps take the arm and pull it down so imagine that you're pushing your hand towards the floor and you should feel this in the back of the arm the triceps good job and switch on to the other side so pull that elbow down towards the ground good job I'm so hungry now. <laughs> I'm always so hungry right after exercise. <laughs> Good. Okay, next, take the um, hands together, so intertwine your fingers, then palms face forwards, and just stretch the upper body forwards. Good job. Hold here, keep it breathing. Super. Really push forwards, and then Take the hands to the lower back and try to squeeze your shoulder blades together. Bring your elbows backwards. Good. Keep breathing. Stretching out all the upper body here. Nice work. Okay, next one. Um, find a wall if you need or you can just stand if you have good balance. Take the foot up to the bum and then we're going to stretch the quad. So push the hips forwards. If you don't feel it, then push the hip forward a bit more. Good job. From all those crazy squat variations today. Three, two, one. Nice job. Other side. So yeah, with this type of training, your metabolism is going to be um, going faster for the next 24 hours or so. Um, so it's going to burn some more calories. Doesn't end here after the hit training. Good. Next for the glutes, so take one leg over the other and then bend down towards the ground. So it looks like this. One leg over and then bend down. If you if this is too difficult, you can do it on the floor as well by pulling the leg towards you like this. Switch sides. Good. So I'll just show you the alternative. Good job. Hold it here. Remember to keep breathing. Nice work. Three. So next one. Keep that going for two seconds more. Then come down to the ground. Now, this one, we're going to push forwards so that we're stretching out the hip flexor. Um, we were using them a lot in the workout today. So this attaches. Um, when we use sit-ups, we're using the abs and these hip flexors. So push here. Now, come backwards, so with that front leg, come backwards so that we're stretching out the hamstring. Straight leg, touch the floor, and you should feel this at the back of the leg. Good job. Hold it here. Four, three, two, one. Hip flexors, other side. So, knee forwards, and then push forwards so that you feel this here. If you don't feel it, then try to move forwards a bit more. Good. Five, four, three, two, one. And again, take that leg backwards, stretch out the hamstrings. If you need to balance on the floor, that's fine. Try to touch the toe for a stretch. Good job. Super. Four, three, two, one. Next, slowly come up to standing. Then we'll stretch out the, um, the adductors. So, sorry, from this one, take one leg in front of the other and then reach down to the floor. So, we're stretching out that hip adductor here. So, one leg and then cross over and then reach down. You should feel this down here. Try to keep the hips straight on. And other side. Reach down. Feel that here. Good. Hold 
but yeah, good job. Five, four, three, two, one. Good. Okay, last one we're going to do. Um, this one is going to stretch out the back. So to explain it, you're holding on to the outside of your knees, and then you're resisting the stretch by holding on to the knees. So from here, we pull our back upwards, but the hands are stopping us from doing it too much, and you should feel a stretch in your back there. So from here, and then pull your back up towards the ceiling. So um, from, Ricky, if you try to curve your back up a bit more, and then can you feel it all down the back? Yeah, so hold that there, just really stretch up. Good. Super work. And then very, very, very slowly come up to standing. Shrug the shoulders backwards. Good. And then forwards. Nice work. And then for the neck, let's just do three circles right. And three left. Back the way. And back. And one more time. And left. And yeah, we're good to go. Awesome work, guys. Hope you enjoyed it and hope to see you soon. Thanks, Ricky. Christina, Ricky. Oh, oh man. Wow, huh? This was a hell of a workout, actually. I like that. Yeah, I knew <laughs> what I was facing when you started out with the warm-up and it wa was already a proper <laughs> exercise for me. <laughs> so, wow. Ricky, you're the husband, My job right? is done. Yeah, he has to live I with me you, for bro. this. <laughs> <laughs> when you can't said, escape actually, it. When you said, uh, Ricky will hate me later, yeah. I was like, I already hate you right now. <laughs> <laughs> However, I get that, I get that um, reaction sometimes, but I like it. <laughs> it was a decent one. I loved it, really. Super. So hopefully you enjoyed it too. Hopefully it euch auch sehr, sehr gut gefallen. Uh, das waren Christina und Ricky, und zwar vom New Wave Gym. Wenn ihr mehr davon wollt, dann schaut auf MyClubs vorbei, die App, oder aber myclubs.com online. Da gibt es die beiden, noch viel mehr von dem Studio und natürlich auch noch viel mehr von unseren weiteren Partnern. Also wenn ihr möchtet, viel Spaß beim Sport. Die Unlimited Stream Angebote sind online. Und wenn ihr möchtet, dann sind wir morgen wieder für euch da mit äh, Bali Yoga. Der Jonathan kommt und er hat einen Vin Vinyasa Flow mitgebracht. Also 18 Uhr ist Yoga Time hier bei MyClubs Live. Bis dahin wünsche ich euch einen schönen Abend. Vielen Dank euch beiden. Vielen That Dank. Really nice. Vielen Thank Dank. So Schönen Abend. <laughs> Goodbye, guys. Ciao. Bis dann. Ciao. <laughs>